Oh, my recording? Sorry. Hi, good morning. Um, I was just calling to give you an update on the progress of our um, embryos. Uh, just to recap, I got a call yesterday saying that two had fertilized and that was it at that point. They were just fertilized. Um, she was supposed to call me today around the same time, which was like 10 a.m. Uh, yesterday and she was supposed to call me around the same time today and let us know how they were progressing and if we were scheduled to do our transfer tomorrow. I need to put shaken. Jeez. Nervous habit. So um, I waited and waited this morning. I tell you um, after 10 o'clock passed, after 10.30 passed, I'm like, okay, why hasn't she called? 11 o'clock came around, still no call. So um, I didn't want to call them, so I was trying to be patient. Um, we did pray this morning. My best friend um, prayed while she's at a layover in Austin at the airport. She prayed with me over the phone. So, um, And I got up super early this morning, and I said a prayer um, while everyone was still asleep. So I just, you know, was praying for a good report. Um, she finally called. I don't know. My husband called me or around 10 30 or 10 15 and I'm thinking it was her and I was so mad I was like why are you calling me but um he was just making sure I was okay because he knew I hadn't heard anything yet because I told him I would call him as soon as I did but anyway um she calls around um 11 30 and she always sounds so nonchalant so you can't really tell what's going on um she said that I sounded a little uh depressed but I was just telling her that, you know, I've been waiting, anticipating. This is one of the most important phone calls, you know, of my life. So um, so then she just got down to the nitty-gritty. She said, we have three embryos. Yes, three embryos. Can you believe it? And I knew it. I'm like, God, I know you gave me a vision that we were having triplets. But then, you know, then you said two fertilized. I'm like, so... You know, was I a prophesier or a prophesier? I didn't know, but at this point, it looks like I'm a prophesier. Thank you, Jesus. So I just um, started to rejoice. She said, one is a grade A for sale. Woohoo. One is a grade B, three cell, and then one is a grade C, two cell. And that's only because um, it was a late bloomer. So we're going to have a late bloomer in the family. But I don't care. I just know and I trust the Lord that they will all take that the vision he gave to me about triplets is going to come to pass. And um, I can't wait to get my big fat uh, BFP. My husband wants to tell, I think I said this in my last video, I'm not sure. But my husband wants to tell his father it's his birthday, his 70th birthday actually. And he wants to tell him that um, he's going to be a grandparent. Um, but they have one grandchild now. I think he's, I think my nephew's around 12 or 13. So they only have one. So this would be a big blessing, but he doesn't want him to tell his mom because then she'll worry and that sort of thing. And we just want to make sure that they take, that it's going to be a good pregnancy before we just let the rest of the world know. So I'm hoping that while he's there, I can take a pregnancy test and at least let them know, yes, we're pregnant. We won't know how many, but, you know, it's going to be three. So I told him I would, you know, do a pregnancy test while he was away, and if it came back positive, then he can tell them. Um, he can take a copy of uh, the ultrasound of the um, embryos and kind of wrap it or whatever. I think it'd be cute. But anyways, um, so that's our status. Scheduled for transfer tomorrow at 1045. And um, hopefully it will all go well. And um, I don't know, I was going to make this my last uh, video vlog, but I don't know, I might update after the transfer tomorrow or after I, I find out we're pregnant. I'm not sure. But uh, needless to say, um, I may not be making another video for a long while. So, um, and if I do, it might just be like some of the other girls where it's just a PowerPoint, you know, giving an update with just the word scrolling up the screen. But um, thanks again for all your prayers, the ones who have supported. Um, I just want to say thank you. God bless you. And I hope that whoever hasn't gotten their B, 
uh, big fat positive that they will get it soon. Don't give up hope. Always trust in God and always pray and believe and trust. Um, that's all I have to say. He is a good God. He loves us. And if it's his will, it's meant to be. And, you know, children are a blessing from him. So why wouldn't he not want you to have children? So um, just, just believe. And it's in his timing, not ours. So just wanted to put that out there in the atmosphere. So, again, until next time, take care. And um, I'll be in touch soon.